afternoon, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. This is Emmanuel. Today is the 15th of June 2023. And today I'm here to talk about a very profitable way to make money online, leveraging on Binance Copy Trading. Yes, guys, Binance Copy Trading. In this uh, short tutorial I'm going to be giving you guys, I'll be showing you guys on how to, you know, engage on the Binance copy trading to make cool money daily. If this is the first time you are coming across my channel, ensure you click on the subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I release a new video. So guys, we'll go straight to our Binance and I believe each and every one of you know about Binance and if this is the first time you are coming across or hearing about Binance I will be leaving a link on the description of this video which you can use to register an account with Binance get your account verified ensure your account is verified looking like this then you are good to go so once your account is verified looking like this, you are good to go and you can be able to engage on the, uh, you know, copy trading I'm talking about. So guys, I will take you guys, you know, straight to what we are here for. So I believe most of my audience know about Binance and probably have been using Binance to trade cryptocurrencies and other, you know, ways to make money on Binance. Today I'll be talking about the Binance copy trading aspect and I will encourage in individuals who have not um, you know, leveraged on this before to start leveraging on this I'm going to share today to make maximum profit you know monthly, daily, weekly. So guys for you to be able to do this um, for you to be able to do this copy trading you need to have USDT so the USDT you need to have need to be on your spot wallet and at least I encourage individuals to have at least 30 USDT for a start you know I encourage you can use as, as a, a minimum of 10 USDT but I encourage people to use 30 USDT to engage on this uh, copy trading I'm talking about so before I proceed I will let me move my my USDT from funding to spot so I can show you guys on how to go about this so guys I just moved my USDT I have uh, which is about 40 USDT as you can see and I'm going to be using it to do this demonstration for you guys <coughs> so you have to you know buy usdt and have at least uh, 30 usdt on your on your usdt section on spots on your spots and once you have your usdt on your spots you have to you know click on features these features down here You have to click on features. Once you click on features, down here, it takes you to this place. Most of the time, it's going to be on this um, USD, you know, margin. That is, if you are coming here for the first time, it's going to be something like this. So you have to click on uh, leaderboard. You can see where the arrow is pointing. So once you click on Liquid board, all these people you are seeing right now are the best, um, you know, features traders, individuals can actually copy. And you can go through each and every one of them and check by clicking on View More. So once you click on View More, you know, you can be able to see most of them and you can see their percentage. There's arrow. OI in a month, in a week, etc. So, what I want you guys to know is um, 
once you click on view more this particular view more it takes you to this page where you have the capacity to you know either view from here you can actually view from this place and check different um, traders and how many people that follows them you know just to see their trade what you have to notice is that uh, you see something like this trade wagon so trade wagon is a kind of uh, in, co in collaboration with Binance to enable you copy trade so what you are going to click on is copy now unless you are a professional trader you should click on become a trader that is individuals can be copying your trade that you are making but for people who want to you know copy trade you have to click on you know trade now copy now so once you click on copy now it's going to take you to somewhere like this so you are going to see something like this for you guys that have just you know started this you have to um, do a kind of um, connection to your binance by clicking one of these people you know once you click on these people they are, they are going to tell you continue with binance so you once you you are going to see continue with binance instead of seeing what you are, you are seeing right now in my screen you're going to see continue with binance you should click on it accept click uh, continue and um, they will ask you to put a kind of um, password which is a one-time password you, uh, a password you can put uh, you can use any of your password you want to use or except a, just a new password that you can remember and at the end of the day you don't need a password to access it again because <clears throat> you access this place through your binance so they don't even necessarily need the password they just have to you know tell you to put password the first time you come to, to this um, interface so the first time you're coming to this interface you are going to undergo that um, process by um, you know continue with binance and then um, put your password <clears throat> so once you do that it will take you back to this place you will see something like this here you can see it's showing you it's showing you seven days return on investment you can see seven days return on investment so all these people you are seeing now is the percentage they have done within seven days of their return of investment you hope you understand me guys and also you can click on this uh, you know pl pnl to see percentage of um, you know they have made on a trade position so you can see these guys have made these guys have made about them um, 291,000 you know 90 989.62 in his um, you know PNL and if you don't know what PNL is, you can check this. This is the main of PNL, so you understand, guys. So that is it. That is what PNL, the main of PNL is. So I'm going to assess my account now, then continue explaining to you guys. So right now, once I click on this place, I'm explaining to you guys what all these things is. This is the seven days um, analysis of their performance in the return of investment the PNL, the win rate, 
and the drawdown. So if I should click on the win rate, you can see that this guy, you know, within seven days he has made trade and he has made trade and within seven days he has not lost anything. Same thing with this guy, same thing with this guy, same thing with this guy, same thing with this guy. So these are all professional traders. So what I will show you guys now is you can click on this place, change it to 30 days. So you can see 30 days. I want you to go with this person I'm going to you know recommend for you guys. So if you go, you know, within 30 days and click on return of return of investment. You are going to see this you know these persons this person you know here is having about um, in 30 days he has made about 1132 percent of return of investment of his capital he is using to trade which is a, which is a very good and powerful you know return it means that this trader has succeeded in uh, you know making about 1132 percent of his capital within one month let's say you are using a um, hundred dollars to trade and you are not even using leverage and at the end of the day you made about 1132 percent of your capital that is roughly maybe around that uh, $1,200 you have made with a $100 uh, capital. So this guy is very good and, and you can see the amount of people you know following him and copying his trade. Same thing for this guy, same thing for this guy. So the, the, these two people, these first two people here, let me show you guys. This and this are always occupied by people. So if, you if I should click on this person now this one if i should click on him he's going to open his analysis and i'm going to tell you guys how to analyze you know this person to know what the performance of this person so right now you can see this is the you know details about his performance within seven days he has made about 5.25 percent of um, his capital trading and this five point something percent you know is it depends on the leverage this guy is using so if this guy is using times five privilege that means he must have made close to i think times five leverage i think he, he must have made close to even 25 percent you know so depending on the leverage he's using but they are actually telling you that you have made about 5.25 percent of his uh, you know this week alone just one in, in one week so guys same thing for the you know pml that is about uh, 54.23 percent the drawback is about um, 3.4 3.74 percent and the win rate is 100 percent what they mean by win rate within seven days he has traded and he had he traded nine trades as you can see he traded nine trades yeah the total trade you can see it here underlined he traded total in seven days seven days total trade he traded nine times and he has a hundred percent you know of it so as you can see seven days win order is nine which means he has win the whole nine trade you know he, he has win the whole nine trade he he placed he was in a you know in a profit he win the whole nine trade he he he, he placed so now one thing I want you guys to notice is this is just um, seven days analysis we are doing, you know, we are doing for this guy now. We are checking his seven days, his performance within seven days, you know. 
and here you can see the margin portfolio so he, he's using about 1087 1087 uh, dollars you know as you can see this is the you know margin balance the money is using for trading and um, with this analysis now you know that within one week this guy traded nine trade and uh, won all of the trades so you can still edit it and check within 30 days so you can click on this to see the 30 days performance you click on all these things down here all these things so you can change it to 30 days instead of seeing it for just seven days so if i should click on this it opens this way then i will choose 30 you can see i'll choose 30 i can choose 30 i can choose 90 so to see his performance within 90 days so if i should click on this you can see that this now is showing me the 30 days ROI of this guy so within 30 days this guy have, you know actually make about uh, 100 1000 132.49 percent of his you know capital he has made good cool returns so at the same time you can change all of them let me change all of them so you guys can see it and see that you can actually you know change it and see you can actually change it and see all the whole trade this guy have done within 30 days so you know so right now everything is showing within 30 days as you can see 30 30 days 30 days 30 days 30 days as you can see so within 30 days this guy actually have taken trades it took about um, 73 trades within 30 days and he has made 100 percent he did not lose that is why you know a lot of people are following him and stuff almost 200 people and he he he, he usually you know he usually gets filled up because a lot of people enjoy his trade and he's a very experienced trader you can see so if i should click on copy let me say i click on copy it takes me to this place and as you can see we are supposed to be on isolated you can see fixed amount isolated so as you can see the isolated is for individuals that are trading from you know from below hundred dollars you understand why the fixed ratio the two is, uh, is even full self the two is even full the fixed ratio is um, is for individuals who you know are trading from hundred dollars upward so as you can see my balance here my spot balance you can see it here showing down here i don't have up to hundred dollars which means normally we are supposed to be on isolated because isolated if i click on the isolated you see portfolio can't be followed fixed amount copy mode is full so as you can see a lot of people have followed him here yeah, about 200 people and i cannot copy this trader again so i have to search for other traders i can copy i'll go back i'll search for this guy i will do the analysis you know by checking his performance you know by if i click on him it brings me to this place i check his um, percentage in seven days his um, PNL, his drawback, his win rates, his trade within seven days. You have to take six trades within seven days, and the, the portfolio margin is using to trade. So I can I can now see that okay, this guy has taken six trade, and all the six trade he took was a very good uh, performance. He have done, you know, a very good performance by, you know putting this trade and ensuring that he, this trade was a win trade. So right now, if I should click on it to change it to 30 days so I can view his performance within 30 days, I can be able to ascertain that, okay, if I should trade with this guy for 30 days, 
what is likely to be the performance of this particular guy you know within 30 days so as you can see he took uh, 99 trades and he won 99 trades so a hundred percent he won you know you know as you can see so anybody that has been following this guy since 30 days ago must have have a hundred percent win rate a hundred percent win rate of um, their portfolios and right now it means the person must have turned the capital about 1043.84 percent so if the person is using hundred dollars to trade by now that person would be holding maybe around that um, i think around that one thousand something dollars you know turning a hundred dollars to one thousand something dollars within a month so as you can see this is what i'm saying these traders has their records and this record is being published by binance their real time performance so you can see that these guys are very very good and they are professional traders so if I should go ahead to click on copy, you can see the copy here. If I should go ahead and click on copy. You can see it's also filled up. A lot of people has the maximum amount of people has copied him and is waiting for him to drop trade for them to you know make profit. Now, like I said. This particular one is for people who are trading from, you know, people who are trading from hundred dollars to fifty thousand dollars, as you can see here. So if you are using below hundred dollars, you cannot trade here. And I encourage people to trade isolated. This isolated. You ensure that it's isolated margin you are trading. Yes, ensure it's isolated margin you are trading. So now. You can see his isolated margin is filled up and I cannot copy him. So I will go to other traders, which the person I'm going to be suggesting for you guys to go to is Cario. Because I've traded with Cario. I've also traded with this guy and this guy, but I've traded with Cario too. And and I assure you that Cario is is very good because you know I've made a lot of money from this. I turned my $30 to 160 dollars within two weeks in less than two weeks you know so this guy know what he's doing you know he knows what he's doing so now he's showing you is you know it does within uh it shows you his returns within within seven days and as you can see that is his pullback. That is minus twelve point um, minus twelve point forty five minus ninety nine. So what this means is, uh, you know, Cario is, if you can see, is the third person we are going, we are checking now, and based on what we are seeing right now, within 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 seven days, Cario has has about 12% um, down and the PNL is about 99% down which is still okay and um, the pullback is about 36.9 uh, 36.94 4 and the win rate is about 100% uh, which is he took he took 13 trades in seven days and he won 13 trades as you can see in in seven days he has been in profit and his um, and his portfolio budget is 701 dollar now we can check the 30 days and analyze how much carry has made in percentage within 30 days So as you can see within 30 days he has made about 
810.71% of his investment or his trading capital and he has made about 2,776% in PNL and the drawback is uh, 38.93% and the win rate, as you can see, the win rate he has is about 98.70%, um, almost 99%. So he took about um, 77 trade and he won 76 out of um, 77. You know, he lost one trade. So that's why you're seeing uh, he, he lost one trade. So it is normal for people to, you know, loss in trading you don't only win in trading it's just that let it be that your winning is higher than your than your loss you understand so guys so this is the uh, uh, margin capital is using so if i should say i want to copy cario before i copy cario you can scroll down i want to do this you know here you can scroll down if you scroll up you see something down here you see view more so if i should click on view more it shows you more details about the 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 you know the trader you want to you know you want to copy first you will know if he's he has opened any position yet you can see current position and there's nothing yeah you can see what he said there's nothing here so for now cardio has not opened a current position and you can go on and look at his trade history you can see if you click on his trade history you see what he has been trading and if he has actually made profit from what he has been trading so for most of you that understand uh, features you can look at this and you see that he's in profit you know he shot this trade this trade is a, is a he shot the trade and he closed the you can see closing price sorry you can see it closing price so the closing price is uh, this That is saying that is he closed it in a profit. He closed it in a profit because he shot the trade, and what is virtually saying that this the, the the coins the price of the coins is going to fall, which if you can see the entry price, you can see the entry price is zero point zero one five one six. And it close it when it is 0 0.0148. That is what he said happened, and he came out, you know, with profit from this trade. So the total amount of uh, money copy trader earnings, you can see it. He, you know, copy trader earnings people that copy him. It's about um, 400 and, uh, 456.62 dollars, and about uh, about 156 copy traders copied the trade and got profit from this trade. So this analyze um, the analysis I'm doing. You can scroll down and you can do it for all of these one after the other and see the trade he took the time he took the trade as you can see this or this trade was yesterday i think he took trade this yesterday on the 14th as you can see on the 14th on the 14th on the 14th on the 14th so about three trades he made on the 14th three trades he made yesterday but today he has not made any trade yet but he made three trades on the 14th and all the whole three trade was a profit you can see 
he came out with cool profit from all this for this daily trade so you can go on and on and see all his um, trade he has been taking for like one month you can see you can use this to navigate and go to all his trade and you can analyze it so this guy has been trading and i've been following this guy i actually used this guy to make close to 60 dollars within four days within four days guys you know so i will be teaching you guys on how to place the copy trade so i'm just showing you guys on how to analyze traders so you can be able to know their performance within one, one seven days one month 90 days etc so you will know if they are actually performing well so you know if you want to copy them and ensure that you are you know following traders that actually open trades that you know perform do a lot enough trade at least you will see some trader trading only just nine times in a month you see but when you have a trader that opens at least from 40 trade upward eh, at least you know that and you see the rate the winning rate and you see that the winning rate is okay you know that it's a trader that is a very experienced trader and experienced traders are individuals who have you know been in this game for a very long time and has been making profit from this you know future trade and decided to you know partner with Binance through this um, trade wagon to give the opportunity to individuals that want to copy their trade so guys if you click on this sorry if you click on this uh, place view more where you see the whole uh, trade he has taken you can still do uh, graphical analysis you know by clicking on this apart from trade history you click on statistic data stat statistical data and you can view their you know performance graphically so you can see this this is a 30 days performance from this guy graphically and you can see that he's way above you know in 30 days he's way above uh, above 700 as you can see so this is on on the on the 8 so on the 8 you can see it on the 8 this guy sorry was even above um, nine uh, around 940.22 percent so as at now today this is a current situation which as of today is around that 88 88 and you can still see it up here showing you so you can see 30 days and you can see the percentage here so if you change it to you know 90 days you can see what you have done so far see 88 point something and you can change it to 100 and something days see 88 something and you can still you know check in 24 hours you can see that is minus six within 24 hours and um, you can check in seven days which we have we have uh, checked already and you can check uh, 30 days to see his performance so now this guy you can go down here you can still go down and view volume so you can see his volume and you can see the trade top three you know top three sim symbols by trading volume you can see the trading volume and you can analyze you can still do some analysis yeah you understand so you can see that the lina is taking is dominating he traded seven times in lina lina usdt he traded seven times and the other ones is uh, this one he traded only just one time with this uh, with this pair with this trading pair so you can still see other analysis here this is seven days analysis if we go to 30 days analysis you can see you know other coins he has traded with yeah he traded with this five times six times seven times i can't see this because of it's too it, it, it's too long so okay this one 
I think this one is higher. So the Lina, the Lina, you have been trading with Lina and you have been making you know profit with Lina recently. So you can still go and do more analysis. But the one I've showed you guys so far, we actually you know give you in a very good head start to it. So if you can see you can see here and you can see win trade win rate 100 percent win rate you can see there's no percentage here win rate with this 100 percent so as you, what what this means is this is trading with this currency pair which is lena usdt perpetual um this year. so and he has win 100 percent of this trade, he have been trading with Lena recently, and most of his trade is successful with Lena, and he has been making 100% of that. Same thing for this um, particular one, this Moro, he has been trading with it, and uh, you know, he has been quite successful with it, as you can see. So right now. This is how to do some kind of analysis. This is seven days. You can change it to 30 days. So you see his performance 30 days with different coins. So you can see this is the 30 days um, analysis. With this when you change it to 30 days from here, you can see the volume, you know, graph, and you can see the performance win rate with you know different currency pairs different currency pairs see how successful he is with different currency pairs so the recent traded you can see recently traded these are the currency pairs he has recently traded on so you know what this guy has been trading on and see his performance with what he has been trading on so far so i i believe this way i'm doing for this uh, particular trader is the way you can do for any other trader and you do concrete uh, analysis to ensure that this trader is very profitable before you copy his trade. So that is what I'm saying, guys. That is what I'm saying, guys. You can still shift and see these uh, deposit and withdrawals, you know, and you can, you know, you can see how much he deposited at, at when he deposited it, and uh, you can still go on with uh, seeing his withdrawals, you know. And this is as good as you know getting full disclosure of the trader you are about to copy. So, so guys, once uh, you can see that this guy is actually profitable, and um, right now, if I should go back, you see that he's you can actually copy this guy because right here is just some um, 60, 65, uh, 165 people that is um, following or copying his trade. So you can do this, this thing I did for Cario now, you can do it for each and every one of these traders. All these traders, you can do it, you can do this analysis. So let me say you want to copy uh, Cario's trade. I'm going to do a live demonstration of this. So you know. So first. So let me say I will pick one of these traders and I will show an example of uh, how to place your copy trade so as you guys must have um, known you just need to keep your usdt on your on your spot wallet on binance and um, you come here to do this analysis and after doing the analysis you pick the trader you want to engage with so let me say i will choose one of these um, traders to engage with so i will choose this particular guy and um, I will click on copy. So as you can see, you can see copy. I'll click on copy here. So once I click on copy, it takes me to this place. And you can see that the isolated is um, is um, open for me to put. And as you can see, I can put from 10, you can decide, you are the one to decide from 10 to any amount of um, uh, capital you want to use to go into this trade you have the choice to choose so 
now as you can see on my on my spot wallet i have 40 usdt and um i let me see i want to go in with 40 usdt so i will put 40 point uh, 40 point Five. I want to go all in with my capital. I put 40.5 in the copy amount. You put the same thing with what you put, uh, you know, up here. Put the same thing here. Then, once you do that, ensure anything you are putting in these places is this is what you have on your wallet or what you decide to use for this trade. Hope you understand me, guys. So now you can see the set set take profit take profit set take profit and stop loss. This is where you have to implement uh, you know risk management for your own account regardless of what the trader itself is setting for his own. So let me say I said okay I want to take profit when I'm getting maybe 30 percent of my capital so look at what they said here i want you guys to read this they said here they said when the estimated margin portfolio you know the estimated portfolio margin balance reaches 52.70 usdt it would trigger take profit market order to close all uh, positions Estimated PNL will be 12 USDT. That means the amount of 12.16 USDT, the amount of money I'll be making if the, the the market goes to you know 30% as as projected, I will be exited out of the market once the I mean profit the, the trade is on profit and is above or around or at 30 percent i will just leave the market regardless whether the market the, the trade will keep on going up i want to exit when i have made 30 percent of uh, profit so that is what it means so for the stop loss is still the same thing but the opposite and as you can see i can still put my stop loss maybe around 30 and say that okay i want to exit the market once i am losing up to 30 percent of my capital you understand so that's why they say when the estimated portfolio margin balance reaches you know 28.38 usdt it will trigger stop loss market order to close all position estimated pnl will be 2.16 for 16 USDT. So it means that if this market is going south and I want to exit the market around 30% loss, I will be losing about 12.16. So you have the capacity to choose any amount you want to use here. You can choose maybe 10%. You want to exit the market once you're using using 10% of your capital. Yeah, you understand or when you are losing 5% of your capital depending on you you are the one to set this now that's why I'm showing you guys so you guys can be able to see that you can be able to do this and you can decide to choose any amount maybe you want to make you want to see the market once you make 5% of uh, profits and once you are making 5% you can see the market you can you know you are the one to put what you want so for, for me, most of the time I do put 30% and in case maybe the trader itself you are copying, close the trade and it's not up to 30% and it's not up to 30%, then you will be giving the profit. Maybe the trader closed the trade when he's making about 10% profit, then you'll be giving, you, you're automatically, once the trade is closed, you will be giving the profit of 10%. That means what you will now see either instead of seeing the 12 consulting dollars you'll be seeing four consulting dollar profit waiting for you there so you have to just come to this place and 
click on stop copying which i'm going to teach you guys and both your capital and the uh, the profit you have made so far will be in your in your will just be in your your spot balance so as you can see whether it reaches 30 percent or any percentage you set it as take profit or not as far as they close the the the, the position on a win trade maybe above or below your take profit you set you will still make your you know your profit based on the percentage the the trader you are copying close the trade so that's what i'm talking about so same thing for the you know stop loss so the stop loss now the trader might decide to stop his loss you know at five percent and maybe you, you you said that you want to stop your own loss at um, at 30 percent or something you 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 have the capability to set you solely have the cap cap capability to set any amount of um, stop loss you want to implement on your you know trade the trader might close the trade once the trader closes the trade automatically your the thing close if you have not gotten to the stop loss you set and the trader close the trade the trader close the trade then you then then if you have the, your take your take um, stop loss has not reached then you will automatically get that means the trader close the trade even before your stop loss reach so it's still favorable to you if you set the stop loss for 30 percent and the trader close the stop loss for 10 percent it means it is to your own favor too you don't have you don't you don't have any problem with that so now what i'm going to do i'm going to set this and um, place an order i'm going to place an order now and i will set it now and uh, place the order I'll, and place the trade so i will copy this trader once you know he placed a trade so right now i will click on 30 percent and i will leave my stop loss at 30 percent too you know or i can leave, leave my stop loss at uh, 20 percent anyone i want i will be the one to choose i just want to show you guys to demonstrate for you guys so right now you have to click on this you have to leave it leave all these settings all these settings you leave it just like that you are using times 10 leverage and this leverage means that uh, it's as if me that's using um 40 40 dollars now to trade it's, a, it's as if i'm using times 10 or 40 dollars to trade that is the times 10 leverage you know ability you are talking about so that being said just leave these settings this way you don't need to do anything here you have to click on this to agree to the terms and condition once you do that then you click on uh, trade uh, submit so once you click on submit it's going to load and it's going to show this I'm going to show this so once you are seeing this you have to view your trade you can see view trade view so if i click on view it's going to open this way and i can be able to view my trade i've already placed view the you know the the, the, the this thing i placed so as you can see it's just here and um, once this trader you know once this trader this trader opens any position automatically my my funds and my account will do the exact same thing you understand and with the take profit and stop loss i've put once you get to that those positions it take me out or you know it's it stop any kind of uh, for that loss like i've set it so that is it guys that is it let me say you are in this you are in this position now and this trader is a close the trade maybe your stop loss or take profit you put did not reach and this trader closed the trade so how can you go about it so what you are going to do is what you are going to do is you are going to go 
open your Binance account this way. I'm having some kind of network issue. I don't know because since today it has been raining all along since morning. So I believe the weather is um, having some issues. So now, once you open your Binance, you click on features. You can see the features down here. You click on features. Sorry. You click on features. These features. So once you click on features, these features, then once you click on features, yeah, you can you can see I'm I'm not I'm having some kind of um, network issue. That is why you can see here you can click on. You are supposed to see all those traders here, but I'm having network issues. Okay, you're supposed to see all these traders around here, yeah, but but what is happening now is uh -uh, is because of the network i don't know why the network is giving some issues i've been trying this since so guys what you just have to do is i will click on this view this view more so once i click on view more it takes me to this place and you can see the trade wagon sign down here so you click on copy now so once you click on copy now it takes you to this side and um, you click on my my copy trading you can see it here so once you click on my copy trading this way it shows you this and once it shows you this you you know once it shows you this, you, you you click on this. You click on this. So once you click on this, it takes you to this place. And in this place, you can see stop copying. So once you click on stop copying, you will first you are going to see your net profit here you're going to see sharing profit sharing profit means you know the fees they will take from you you know doing this there's some fee they are going to take from you doing this uh, doing this uh, copy trading so as you can see there's a current position right now open and um, the current position right now open is uh, showing the current uh, this thing so i can actually close the position if i want or i can leave it to, to run so as you can see it is happening live right now and let's see how everything goes you know let's see how everything goes as expected so now once you click on stop trading your capital and your profit is going to be sent directly just it's going to appear on your on your spot wallet as you can see it's going to appear on your spot wallet so as you can see that is if the trader closed the position before your take profit reach so you have to click on this stop trading or stop copying sorry for it for you to get both your capital and the profit you have made so far so guys that is it that is it it's as simple as that you can stop copying by coming to this place the way i did it you know and um, you are good to go you don't have any problem so if you know you have gotten value from this video ensure you click on the like button and uh, ensure you subscribe if you have not done that yet I'll be closing, you know, I'll be closing and rounding up this section now and I'll be, you know, communicating to you guys more on this. Thank you and remain blessed. Bye for now.